Ah. Anyway, nine. With Final Fantasy Nine. With Final Fantasy Nine. What was that? You see, I, I, I think nine is kind of like the opposite to seven. It's where seven one with seven. I don't think it's overrated because everyone says it is. With nine, I don't think it's underrated because everyone says it is. I think with nine. There is. I don't really find anything special about Nine. I don't get me wrong. I do think it's a good game. I just think it's not brilliant. There's nothing really good about it. Now, I know a lot of people. A, peop, a lot of Far Fantasy Nine fans tend to go on about how, ooh, it doesn't take itself seriously. It's okay, fine, whatever. Ooh, it's old school. As if that makes it good somehow. Look at a lot of the old school games that are still good even after all this time. You got Sonic the Hedgehog, Super Mario, Pac-Man is still actually going pretty strong. So there are a lot of old school games that actually are still really good even in today's world. Yeah. 10. Now, like with it, 10 is, I think, one of the best, but the stupid side quests. See, like I said, you're letting one little negative about a game ruin the entire game for you. That is a little thing that most people would refer to as a pessimist. Someone who looks at the negatives more than they do the positives. Probably even someone like Tubers93. Who like, who enjoys that chocobo racing, where you, that chocobo thing where you've got practically no control over the chocobo and you get smacked with birds regardless of which way you go, it's just luck with that and you have to try it over and over again. Who enjoys weaving through butterflies and... <laughs> I, I probably sound like a jackass saying this, but the way he pronounces words like butterflies and chocobo... His accent just makes it sound hilarious. I'm sorry, but it, it does. Dodging lightning bolts. None of that is fun, but the sphere grid and the way that it's done that you... Um, like, you can remove parts and put new parts in and build up on it and, like, edit the whole thing. It's really well done, but the side quests... <sighs> Again, you're letting one bad thing about a game ruin the entire game for you. Not exactly something that most gamers would do. Eleven is an MMO. Not played it. Don't have any interest in playing it. Then why did you even include it in this video in the first place? Whatever. Twelve is so underrated, I find. I don't think it's one of the best, but it, it's so different in its gambit system and it's I find it to be really interesting but I mean I, I'm telling you if this game was not Final Fant called Final Fantasy and if this game was marketed as something else it would do better I think in in terms of maybe not in terms of sales but in terms of general overall opinion of the game because because people are really just that shallow I think it's a really fun game. It's really... It's a game for people that like to admire their own work. They like to monitor situations. They like to... I find it's the most immersive of the series, if you get what I mean. I, fi I feel like I'm more there than with any other game. Now, I know people are going to say, well, that's not true because you don't do anything. You just set the gambits and let them go. And I'm thinking, yeah, but it's so vast and so, like all the gambits you set up yourself so it's like you you are command you are giving like commands for stupid please please stop stammering okay you're just making yourself look like an idiot uh, conditions that you have to meet to get some of the stuff to work like oh you need this monster up here or oh, wait here for five minutes or or you want to get this zodiac spear don't open these particular chests I know I said this earlier in the commentary, but that sounds a lot like a Fire Emblem game to me. It's, some of the stuff is just stupid, but overall, a very underrated game, and I'll tell you what, 12. I, 12 is one of those games where I have been, I have been happy to grind.
I have been happy to grind, especially at the beginning of the game. Grinding at the beginning of the game is so much good, like better in 12 than in most games. And I don't know how to ex describe it. But yeah, 12 underrated is what I would say. Um, 13, I think 13 is good in the same way that 4 is good, but I think 13 is slightly better. 13, it's more like, um, it, it, um, I would say, it's, you know, people say 13 is linear. I think, in a way, 4 is more linear, because, yeah, the paths aren't as linear, but the character development and the character... Really, all you're doing is just repeating the Final Fantasy IV thought you had. Character selection is just as linear, if not more. But with 13, at least you have some sort of choice with which roles you level up and which um, something else stuff, which paradigms you've got set up and I think that's kind of 13 is really the thing I find with the battles in 13 is that you don't do as you don't have as many options to choose from but the options that you do have you have you, there's more to consider when you're making those choices it's again that you're monitoring the flow of the battle and all that and I think it's a, I really like that system I don't like it more than the others but it's new and it's just I find it interesting and all these people who are saying oh, all you do is auto attack auto attack auto attack and go ooh I need to heal switch to medic and it, yeah I really don't think that's like <laughs> such a big thing that I mean it's not like in other games you don't heal when you have to heal and you okay earlier you were letting relatively minor issues ruin the game for you and you're not doing that here uh, I'm calling bias use this when you have to use that it's it, it's it's just a different style as for Final Fantasy 14 it's why are you giving your thoughts on Final Fantasy 14 if it hasn't even come out yet? It's going to be another online game. And quite frankly, I can't really be bothered with it. I might try it a bit just to get a taste of MMOs in general if I really feel up to it, but I'm not going to pay like monthly to play a game. Okay, that's it. I'll see you all next time. Okay, uh, Velocity11, before I go here, I really gotta say that, uh, don't get me wrong, just because I'm doing a commentary on this video doesn't exactly mean that I, it's a bad video, but I do think that there could have been more to it than there was, so, uh, just, uh, just, please don't unsubscribe, please. <laughs>